and welcome to another excellent Minecraft adventure. Hi guys, I'm Superfly, he's Rama, it looks like we're going to go on a maiden voyage, he's got the train all prepared, I shall, uh, I shall enter first class on this very fine day. Guys, we finished the uh, line last episode, the link is down below if you want to watch that. Uh, also, if you can take your time, it doesn't take long at all, the subscribe button is also below. I'm going to go for a quick maiden voyage around this track. We're also going to keep an eye out for uh, some nice areas that we, we could do some future builds on. And uh, we've got uh, we've got a future build in mind at the moment. We just need a nice place to do it. And that's uh, we'd like to do a quarry. Simply because the uh, mine shafts down below are looking a little bit like catacombs at the moment. Um, there's not nowhere else to build or mine. So I think a quarry would be quite good. We're not going to use uh, the quarry mod or anything like that. We're literally going to do the quarry by hand. And uh, it'd be a good way to mine. Also create a good feature. And we're going to incorporate it into the design of the track as well. Which I think will look really good. So we're going to keep his eyes out, guys. We're just coming through the, uh, the underground desert area. If you recall, this is where we, we found the desert temple. And we've kind of just built it into like a little subway station. A little crafting table at the back there. Moving out all across the ocean area. And on our left, ladies and gentlemen, you will see Rama's shipwreck. And if you remember, guys, we found Rama. The episode link is down below. Shipwrecked. As I came exploring, looking for a coastline. I'm just entering the desert station now. And just leaving the desert station now. <laughs> Not a particularly massive station, but it'll serve its purpose. We're hoping to have some sort of uh, theme going on around this area here sometime. We'll get around to it. Coming down to what we, we believe is uh, Bounty's little cutout he made. When it keeps disappearing. Speaking of which, uh, I've noticed the uh, one of the blimps is gone. Up there. I don't know if you've noticed as well, Rama. So I think, he's, uh, I think he might be out on the blimp exploring. And if you can recall, this is where we decided just to crack on with the line. And just get it all finished. Which should, when it loads, lead up to... There she goes. There she is. A lovely bridge up yonder. Up yonder, Ferris. <laughs> uh, that, uh, that resides across a waterfall. Oh, look at that in all its majestic. And we're coming up, and we should be coming up behind the waterfall now. Look at this. Oh, wow. Excellent. Slow going, it's chugging, it's chugging. There we go, and we're coming up across the bridge. Beautiful, beautiful. Through some cutouts. Very simple uh, cobblestone cutouts, guys. Yeah, I'm just coming up around here. It's a nice big open area there that could do something in there. I have no idea yet. What? We could do with a station somewhere as well. Another station. I what we're like further out in the, the temp in the desert area. Did a time lapse bridge here, guys. If you remember, the link is down below. Brilliant time lapse bridge. Oh, this looks a good area. I think Rama's seen it as well. Remember, guys, we talked about looking out for a quarry. That down there, let's, let's dismount. Ooh. That down there, guys, could be good. In fact, it looks really good. Look at Rama getting his eye biz on. What the heck? <laughs> I was just like thinking to myself just said, how are we going to get over this fence and there's a gate there who would have thought <laughs> oh yeah oh that's massive area that is a, that is oh yes of course guys uh, Corey can only go uh, can go quite deep oh. but for us to get down to the quarry quite easily we need it to be quite wide 
And I think this is brilliantly wide as this. Let's get... Uh, oh, killing all the animals. Oh, got a couple of elves down here. That we can cut into. That's no problem at all. Oh, but, whoa! Crikey. Well, if we're going to kill all the animals, let's, let's make a fun time of it. I'm having you, piggy. You can go down that hole or die. <laughs> I knew we missed a sheep. Oh, I'll okay. chop myself here. Yep. Come on, there we go. A little bit of parkouring. <laughs> Which I'm rubbish at. Oh, this is amazing. This is massive area. Look at that little hole up there. That little cave there. Whoa. Crikey, I just don't know, <laughs> you don't know where you're running here. You can just run into a to a hole on the floor. Oh, look at this cave here. How do we get up to it? Let's try up here. Yep. Whoa! And two creepers just to greet me. <laughs> one blows another one up. Uh, right. Oh, crikey. How much stuff's in here? That'll do. <laughs> Right, I'm going to stick a torch in here before it gets too dangerous. Torch off 13. Crack it. All that spawned out of that area. My word. Oop, I can hear something up above. Nope, looks like it's dead. I just envisaged me walking out there and a creeper just blowing up on top of my head. <laughs> oh, this is perfect area to do uh, to do uh, a quarry there, Rama. Uh, ooh, wow. That bridge from here. That's a beautiful bridge. Oh, this would be perfect. You can actually see the quarry. Cracky ram is already cracking on. Oh, I thought we were going to systematically size it all up. You know, use a bit of science. <laughs> Maybe not. Wow, I think he's got an enchanted uh, shovel there. Speaking of which, I do need to enchant uh, another shovel. This one's almost out. I think the next shovel will... Uh... In fact, I'm level 28 now. I'm not far off uh, level 30. Which, you know, guys, uh, we use to uh, capture your um, your XP into books. Well, I think that's enough of that there, Rana. We've got... Uh... Ooh... Yep, yeah, hang on. Coal. Always need a bit of coal, guys. Oh, this looks like the old way of uh, when we first started playing Minecraft. We just dug straight down. Uh, might need to uh, draw this out a little bit further. That's better. Do that. Whoa. What the heck was that? It was Rama. What's he signifying? What the... I hope that did not land on that wooden bridge. <laughs> oh, of course, we found out that uh, burning arrows don't actually start fires, which is pretty cool. Um, How do we find our way back up here? There we go. That's a, that's a good idea, Ram. I didn't want to get carried away on that just yet. Plenty of episodes to uh, crack on with a quarry. And here's the gate. Look at that. Do you know what? Rama, if we're going to have a quarry over there, cracky, you can see it there, just started. Why don't we have a quarry station somewhere? And I'm thinking, now stay with me on this, I'm thinking... We could have the station straight after this bridge ends, just here, all the way along the straight, and perhaps have some. Uh, we could have some lines branching off. What not? Could lead down to the quarry. We could we could even build like a little quarry shunter or something like that. That can uh, we can haul all the uh, all the stuff that we uh, mine all the way back to the house. That sounds cool. All right. Yep. Yeah. That's the oh, excellent guys. We have just. You guys have just witnessed the birth of a quarry.
<laughs> right, driver, onwards. Come on, chop chop. Be snappy about it. Oh, look at him. He has to get into his engineer's uniform as well. Into his ivories when he comes out the train. Into his God, you must be a nightmare to work with. All unionised and everything. Not paying you. Not paying you at all. Just to set up a blooming union. Right. Oh, yeah, that's going to be an awesome. God, you can even see where we started it there. Excellent. Anyway, this episode's about the maiden voyage. <laughs> so let's crack on. Beautiful. Okay, came around here. Remember we were doing a little time-lapse uh, episode. The link is down below. If you'd like to have a look. Please don't judge my singing on that episode. Got carried away. <laughs> It's a nice little line, this, actually. So our second train, then, looks like it's going to have something to do with the quarry. Going to leave it up to Rama. He's the train expert here. That uh, Well, he's not really a train expert, even though he says he is. He's uh, He knows a bit about a couple of engines and which sort of engines to use, I think. You guys might want to comment in and sort of ask what engine you'd like to see for the quarry. That'd be cool. And if you're going to do that, please hurry up, because we probably will have built the engine by then. <laughs> Coming into the uh, first of two desert tunnels. This is the longest of the two. <laughs> Keep snug to the train. Look at where I am on the train. I feel like I'm in one of those uh, movies where we're having a fight. We're crawling along the train. I'm going after the bad guy. I'm James Bond and I'm going after the bad guy. Going through another tunnel. Dive down. And out of the second tunnel. The smaller of the two. And we're on the final straight to the house. I've got a funny feeling, guys. This, we, we, we decided to uh, face the train this way because it gives us a good sort of view of the house as we approached it. Although my uh, draw distance isn't on far, but uh, hopefully it'll give a good impression on this main advantage. The windmill's just come into view. Down below, guys, for the uh, episode links. There's two episodes uh, based on that. And up to our lovely house, which, if you subscribe to our channel, link down below, guys, you get to see how we built it all from scratch. I'm just pulling up into the station here. Boop, boop. <laughs> Boop boop, said Swen. Ah. Beautiful. I'm really pleased with this engine. Dismounting. Excellent. Well, I actually thoroughly enjoyed that. Got us to a few destinations. Full circuit, all the way back here. Is Ben still out? He's still out. But middle... Uh, Middle Zeppelin is, uh, is still gone. Actually, I can't say Zeppelin properly. Zeppelin. Zeppelin. <laughs> wonder where he is. It's not over... Uh, we never even... I mean, you didn't see him on the journey, did you? Flying around or anything like that. I must have gone out searching quite, quite a distance. Well, anyway, guys, that's it. That's our maiden voyage on the uh, line. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you'd like to subscribe... Please click the link below, leave a comment or two, say how you like the episode. And uh, on that note, remember guys, stay crappy!